Hello, Habibi here. In this video tutorial, I'm going to talk about load more button in JavaScript. In this tutorial, let me show you how to create a load more button. For example, if we have an array variable here, we have this page. Let me create an array variable in JavaScript. Let's say we have a variable called items for items and the it and the content of this array variable is like one two three four five and six yes for example we have these variables and we are going to show the users this element and then we have a load more button if user click load more the uh, user will see the second element and the and then third element fourth element and so on so for example let's create the button here load more okay and if the user click this button we will call this method on click load more and then we create the function here function load more let's see the page okay here is the page we have this load more button which let me show the developer console so this is the load more button let's uh, okay first thing I'm going to do is to create a variable current index I call it current index and its value if, if is zero uh, then load more functions if we call this function or method it's it should show two elements of this array so what we are going to do is to create uh, first here a, a div element with id content and like this if if you click load more button we will do this uh, we are going to call the loop for far i equals to zero i less than items dot length let me do this first i plus plus then i content dot append item Div and div items i let me uh, include javascript here we need to javascript ah uh, no jquery i mean jquery cdn So I'm going to take this one, minify it, uh, copy this script and paste it here. Uh, here. So let's let's test this load more button by clicking this load more. Okay, lo let's click it. Oh nothing happened. Let me see. Load more on click load more content div id content length length okay okay let's try again item is not defined items items dot length 
I am I okay let's try again now we have one two three four five six so this is what uh, we see with if we click this load more button but this is not we want I want first initially load initially I will call this function but I need to only show two elements I need to I need to only show two items here so here current index the value of current index is zero initially it is zero and I will uh, I will create another variable inside this function called for max result the max result should be 2 for example and then here at the end of the loop if the loop is done I'm going to update the value of current index to be equal to be equal to max result here we need to update the value of current index with plus equal max result so each time this function is called initially the value of current current index is zero then each time it will be added by this max result if we click this once the value of current index will be two and the next time if we click it if we call this function again the value will be two plus max result which is four so here in uh, this part I'm going to add plus max current index so let's let's see the page here is the page uh, I'm sorry current index items here I need to change it to max result okay so we have only these two elements here and if we click this button it will load the next elements one two and three four and let if we click it again here is here are the next elements the problem now is we the problem now is we can still see this button and showing undefined items to solve this problem let's refresh it to solve it it's easy here in this loop we can check if the value of max uh, if the value of current index is more than items dot length what we can do is to hide load more button let's add an ID let us let's assign an ID to this button LM button so if the value of current index is more than items dot length we can hide this button so we cannot click that again and here we uh, add return to quit this loop okay let's try again load more load more load more oops sorry uh, maybe we can add equals or more or equals equals or more more or equals okay let's do it now if we reach the end of the elements it will hide the load more button let's add another element for example uh, something like this okay and test it again load more load more load more load more 
and finish that is what I am sharing with you the in this video I hope it is useful I hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching see you next time